truthful, baby. Baby, for real. For real. Overload, overload. This is like I got like my pinky, my pinky. Money, baby, we don't fake with ARs. Bet it back, I bet I match it like the same style. Chopsticks for beef from shutting PF chains down. I gave you prophecy, my first one, then you lame down. Luckily, so, but it wasn't for me. Still the flow raw, peep the way I bubble in these streets. Who can f with me? Nikki, baby. Go, go, go. All right, Coach, thanks. We are across the Cumberland River from downtown Nashville at Nissan Stadium in Tennessee. Coming up, it's Divisional Round Saturday, and we've got an AFC battle on tap between the New England Patriots and the Tennessee Titans. The first of four berths in the conference championships on the line here as divisional weekend in the NFL is underway. And they will not get a chance to return this one as it's through the end zone for a touchback. They go play action here on first down to Michelle on the dump off. And he takes this up to the 40-yard line before being corralled. They may want to go back to that one. First play of the drive, good for 15 and a first down. Nice little nifty play for him there. Yeah, that's the ability to read a defense and utilize players that don't often get picked up in coverage easily. And I'm talking about being able to use the backs out of the backfield. Because I know that when I used to cover, Hey, we got everybody cut. Oh, he just snuck out there, and they just got a nice push down there. What do we love to say? Get those backs into space, right? And they were able to do that there. Nice pickup on first down. Bringing him down defensively, Jayon Brown. I call that play a success. A nice inside run sets up a very manageable second down, a very solid gain on that play. Now Brady. And that's going to be too high. Out of bounds and incomplete. Antonio Gates, the veteran tight end, was the intended receiver. And it'll bring up third down. Working from the gun, it's Brady. And he's got Snead. And he's able to get this one down to the 40-yard line. No catches for him in the wild card win last week, but he's got a first quarter grab here. So operating from Tennessee territory now. Here's first and 10 right at the 40. On the handoff, it's Michelle. And he's taken down inside the 30. 11 more yards that go around, a first down as well. So back-to-back -back big runs, picking apart this defense on the opening drive. I thought this was a passing league. I thought this was the <laughs> era we were in where the ball was always in the air, right? They didn't get the memo. They didn't get the memo, and I know this to be true. Offensive linemen still, to this day, they want to run the football. They want to fire out and hit people across the line of scrimmage, and they're clearing space. Another big hitter there. This one good for 18. The Patriots into the red zone for the first time. They've got a first and 10 at the 11. A give. This is Michelle. And able to push his way forward here for a good little game. Five yards on the carry. Good pickup on first down. 
A quick burst there, and he nicely bit off a pretty decent game. Now Brady throwing on second down. And caught by Thomas for a New England touchdown. Demarius Thomas from six yards away. And the Patriots drive right down the field and score on the opening drive. Goskowski with the extra point. And that makes the score 7-0. Goskowski now out to kick it away. This is fielded at the chalk of the 10. And a nice spin into some open field. And he finally runs out of gas, but not before he's inside the 10-yard line. Similar to golf, you never want to count a score before it actually happens, but you have to figure. They thought they were going to get six on that play. Great effort to keep them out of the end zone, but a big-time return. The first red zone opportunity for the Titans. They're looking at a first and goal from about the nine. They'll try to run for it with Henry. And yeah, this play doesn't go anywhere. Backwards, losing yardage to the 11. So the myth has been shattered. Every cornerback in the league is not just a cover corner. Some of them will stick their nose in there and make plays exactly as we just saw there. A big loss suffered by the offense after that nice tackle. They get it to him running left. And running room hard to come by here. He gets it down to the eight. Only a couple yards there, and that's going to set up a long third and goal. Partner, I know we're in a goal-to-go situation, but my goodness, think about running the ball here, not even a thought, yeah, is it? defensively, they're in a prime spot. And I think the defensive guys are probably expressing themselves to them as well. I wouldn't run it here, guys. You might want to try throwing it. Third and goal, Mariota. And that is caught by Davis for a Tennessee touchdown. As his guys are in for six. And the Titans are an extra point away from tying this thing out. And man, Charles, talking about zinging something in there. Those gloves, they help with one-handed catches, the fun stuff. Any padding for a rocket like that? One would think so, but I'll guarantee you this. After that throw, his hands will hurt later. Not right now in the moment. He's just feeling good about catching it. Yeah, a little stinger, but a touchdown. Out comes the New England offense to see what they can do this time. And they're hoping to redo their efforts in the last drive when they got into the end zone. And just think of what it's like now on the sideline. Because when you score a touchdown, you have to go over and look at the tablet and see what you did on the last drive. When you scored points, it's a whole lot better view than when you're trying to figure out how to fix things there. They begin with Michelle on the ground. And he'll wind up with about six, up past the 30 to the 31. All right, Brand, I know we're in the early going here, but those kind of runs, they're going to open up a world of opportunities go, go. for this offense going forward. They'll come up now second and four from the 31. Second down, Michelle. And he'll get this up only to about the 33. The Super Bowl hero, Malcolm Butler, makes a stop. Well, that's all about doing the dirty work right there defensively. Second and short yardage, that's all about plugging those gaps, not giving a running back a crease to run through, and has a nice job to hold him just a couple and force a third down. Brady looking to throw on third and two. And unable to connect. If he had caught it, it would have been a first down. Instead, it's fourth. 
You can tell they were hoping for a flag there offensively. Several on the sideline motioning. Hey, why not a penalty? Why not a penalty? I, what did you see? Yeah, I think you've got to let them play. And the officials are instructed. If there's contact coming from both sides, no flag. Let them fight it out. And forces fourth down. And here comes Tennessee as they get sent to take the field. The last possession, these guys were able to tie the game with a touchdown, and now they'll have a chance to move out in front. Yeah, let's give a big yeah, assist yeah, to the defense who got the ball back. The special teams went out there, handled things. They've got it. They've got momentum. I know they're eager to get out there and put it on display. Now a play fake here on first down. Oh, he got position on him, and he pulls it in. 23 yards on the play. The goal for any offense versus his own defense, find the holes where guys are available and put the ball on the receiver before any defender can step up and fill it. They did it well there. Perfectly executed crossing route. So one play, and they're already just shy of midfield. down, Mariota. Man open left side is Brown. And into the end zone for a Tennessee touchdown. A big play there. 52 yards. And the Titans get the quick strike touchdown. Extra point put through by Suckup. And that makes the score 14-7. Now here's Suckup out to kick it away. And that'll carry over the back line of the end zone for a touchback. And the Patriots gearing up to go now. And hoping to do better than they did their last possession when they punted the football. Appeal to the vanity of your offensive line. Tell them that they control your fate. Leverage guys. Win the line of scrimmage. If you do that... You start to win first down. You win second down. And guess what? You start accumulating first downs. And that's what they need in order to not punt the ball again. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. He had two catches in the wild card game, and he's matched that total in the first quarter here in this one. And a first down as well. One play has him up past the 40 already, and another first and 10. On first and 10, here's Brady. He couldn't quite hold it. Got hit. Ball pops out. Incomplete. That would have been a great catch, but it was real difficult to hold on to it because it was contested all the way. Would have been a great play if he had been able to haul that one in. So second down, still 10 yards to go. Ball on the 43. Looking back to the air on second down. It's Brady. He uncorks it for Sneed. And he fires one that's intercepted. Picked off by Logan Ryan. And he brings it back to right around the 26-yard line. Ah, Brandon, this is a veteran quarterback back there. He should know better than to make a throw like this. This is definitely not his best ball. And I think he knew this was trouble the second it was leaving his hand. Mariota and the Titans break the huddle first and 10 at their own 26. Following the interception here, Mariota. He's going to rifle one deep left side. And that's caught inside the 30. With the former volunteer Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon. It's the Titans with the football here to begin quarter. So now then, the big play has him all the way inside the 30 now, first and 10. Mariota now to throw on first down. Flushed out right. Nice work to get seven out of that, and it's second down. Now, that was not a bad scramble there on first down. He didn't force it, nor did he throw it away. He was able to take off, and now he made it a very manageable second and short. Second down, Mariota. It's complete to Brown, right side. And he'll go down here at the 12-yard line. 
Two catches now in this divisional round matchup. That one, a first down. And boy, they had high praise for this rookie receiver when we asked the coaches about him, didn't they? They certainly did, and obviously they liked his measurables, otherwise they wouldn't have brought him on to the team. Height, weight, speed, all of that. But how about what they really said? Competitiveness. That's what they really liked about him. The way he goes after the football, competes for it, and decides when it's in the air, it's his and only his. And he's going to fight his way forward here for a modest gain. Five yards is the tally on first down. That brings up second and five. Despite the blitz, they're still able to pick up a nice, solid gain. The disadvantage of blitzing often alters the normal spacing and run fits and leaves creases like they were able to exploit right there. They keep it on the ground. This time it's Henry. And that one blown up quickly as he's going to be stopped before he could even get started. It'll be a loss of a yard, and just like that, it's third down. The pitch to Henry. Treads the tackle, and he'll be stopped just outside the five at the six. Just a yard on the run there, and that's going to bring us to a fourth down. I know the scouting report on him is that he doesn't possess the eye discipline to be an elite linebacker. And what that means is his ability to read, react, and make a play. But on that one, he looked like one of those guys. That drive took him inside the 10. Good job defensively to hold him to three. Yeah, I like how you did that. Give a little tip of the cap to the stop troops there because they didn't give up a touchdown in that situation, right? Made him kick the field goal. And yeah, points went against them, but that feels a whole lot better running off the field. Now the Patriot offense set to take over again. And following the interception, just any interception, are you a little bit more cautious when you start that next drive, or no, you just throw that out the window? I think you are. I don't think that there's any way you can run back out there and go, ah, totally didn't affect me. Let's just go ahead and be trying to get it to Thomas, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Logan Ryan. And they will be set up now as he brings this thing all the way back inside the 20. He couldn't get the hook up there that time with Thomas. Oh, and I saw the pressure coming at him. That just looked problematic. Hit him as he threw it, and the interception ensued. Let me pay homage to the man who stood in this spot before. He always talked about how much pressure is in the face of a guy, and can he step into a throw. And when you can't do that, oftentimes interceptions result. Mariota on first down. Got a man, and it's taken in for a Titans touchdown. Marcus Mariota with his third touchdown pass of the afternoon. And the Titans are going to add on to their lead. And he puts it through. Now here's Suck about to kick it away. This will be fielded at the 8. Bust through the tackle. And he's up across the 25 and down at the 28-yard line. Now the Patriots offense, they work their way back out onto the field. And last time, one play interception. So this offense, they should be fresh. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good way of putting it. And I can't wait to see what they decide to do with play calling. Because a one-play drive where you throw an interception... A lot of people think the very next time out, run the football, don't give them a chance. Maybe play action. I think maybe you go play action, show your quarterback, get a little confidence in him, and let him fling another one. Yeah, they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. 15 yards is the pick up there, and the drive starting very nicely. First down. One play has him up past the 40 already, and another first and 10. Brady now on first down. And Brady going to be intercepted a third time. Picked by Kevin Byard, And they will set up shop at their own 46-yard line. He was going for Gates, his tight end that time. Mariota and the Titans break the huddle first and 10 at their own 46. They'll start things on first down with Deion Lewis. And they'll get him down as he's inside the 40. 
Now a timeout being called as there's an injured Titan down on the field. While the training staff works on him, we'll step aside and be right back. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. A first down throw for Mariota. And right side hitter's got it. Touchdown, Titans! Derrick Henry, 38 yards. And the Titans find...